I'm back. What's up guys? It is week four. We made it. I'm super excited. Thanks for joining me on another video. My expansive channel, I think we're up to six subscribers, so big numbers. I'm looking out for sponsorships and merch deals, so stay tuned. Um, yeah, so today's Sunday, uh, May 24th. Happy birthday to Michael. It's his birthday today, um, my roommate, so there you go. Um, there's your present. But um, yeah, so I'm actually joined with a dog today. Uh, my friend Nathan, um, I'm dog sitting for the day while Nathan's doing something fun, but uh, it's a poodle. His name's Oliver, and you'll see him in the video. So, he's cool, he's licking his paw. I can relate, I suppose. So, this week's been really good. Um, I'm super happy. So in the last video, we talked about a little bit of like failure and like um, dealing with urges and cravings and things like that. And um, I have to say, I had, like, I think Wednesday this week was bad. I basically it was like a cheat day on accident. But uh, other than that, uh, week went really well. Um, I'm super happy about it. Um, I saw some good progress on the weight loss and progress pictures and stuff. So I'm going into that section. Um, I'll show you all uh, the progress. Um, I'm just super excited about it all. Uh, I usually would film these videos in the morning of Sunday, but I've eaten a little bit today. So when I do the physique update and all that, my, I don't know how much I'm bloating, whatever, but it doesn't matter. I took the picture earlier, so we're good. Um, yeah, I got, uh, hopefully this vlog will be a little bit more exciting. Um, I filmed some stuff earlier this week. Um, not too much, but I got a little bit of a workout with my friend Josh. I'm uh, just doing some cow at home. Um, my hair looks terrible. But other than that, yeah, I mean, I may try to film some stuff today. So this vlog will probably come out on Monday. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, this week was a lot better for me. So my median weight of the week is 308.0. So I got about a 1.8 pound, I think, loss. Uh, super happy about that. That's right where I want to be. Um, like this, so yesterday and today, I weighed both the same weights in the morning. I was like 305.8, but because I'm doing the median, I'm just taking that 308. So hopefully next week's will be up. If I maintain this kind of progress, it'll be decently lower. Again, I'm trying to shoot for under 300. That's my number one goal right now. And it's uh, super exciting to inch closer every week to that. So that's exciting. We are now officially 10 pounds down. Um, now let's keep it off this time not have a really bad week like last time. So it's a really good motivating force for me. And um, yeah, I'm super hyped. I keep on moving forward. Always getting closer. March until it's over. And just like a soldier. I keep on moving forward. Always getting closer. I'm marching till it's over. Like a soldier, I keep on moving forward. Always getting closer, marching till it's over. I'm just like a soldier, I keep on moving forward. Always getting closer, marching till it's over. I'm just like a soldier. Holy crap! Me and my boy Josh, we just knocked it down three sets. I'm absolutely gassed. I have another workout in like four hours or so uh, with my friend. So I don't know if I'll film any of that, but we're trying to put in some work, get this going. Thanks for watching so far. So, my guys, uh, so after that workout, we went on a walk. It started raining, so we ran for the last quarter mile. Um, not gonna lie, it was kind of fun. I just running out in the rain. Uh, it was really refreshing, but we have some big storms coming in, so we we're trying to beat it. But it looks like we didn't get to, so.
into the physique stuff. Okay guys, so um, we're here for the physique update. I'm gonna kind of show you what I'm looking like. So also last time I used my 50 millimeter lens uh, and that was rough. <laughs> so I'm trying to remember to switch over to my kit lens when I do these. That's not as high of aperture. But um, yeah, here's what we're looking with. I'm actually pretty happy with um, where we're at right now. I mean, it's definitely, again, later I'm gonna throw up some progress pics, but the stomach's definitely coming in a little bit. So, um, that's definitely super good. I don't know, but... I, I got to work out in the gym, so... I don't know, maybe something with muscle will one day happen. Let's look at the back. Yeah. Nothing too much here. But yeah, um, so I mean, I'm feeling pretty good. Uh, definitely, you know, a better week. So yeah, let's get back to the living room. All right, so uh, that was the physique update. And so now um, I just took my measurements and so I'm gonna go over those real quick. So last week I had stomach 51 and this week I have stomach at 49. So it looks like I had about two, around two inches lost, um, which is super good. Uh, I'm just not quite as like, I bloated, I suppose. And so um, that, that's good, it makes me look a little bit better. Uh, super happy about that. Everything else I think is about the same. Chest was down about an inch, um, give or take. So a little bit improvement here. Um, also genetically, like me and my brother and my dad, we all just have really prominent just like ch chests. They just stick straight out. So if I gain fat in my chest, like it just like Mount Rushmore straight, you know, just kind of, we're going out, you know, we're here to play. <laughs> I don't know what that means, but it doesn't like sag down. So we have a really full chest. Um, if I was a girl, I'd probably be killing it, but oh well. Uh, bicep, still about 17. Not surprised there that, you know, I haven't done, well, I was in the gym one time because it's still hard to get to gyms. Um, thigh, still about 28. I, again, I try to go to the, bigger part of the mid thigh, kind of where your underwear might stop if you're wearing like briefs. Um, waist 48 still. So yeah, um, definitely, I mean, I'm pretty happy with it. I haven't gone up in anything um, and I've been down a little bit in the stomach, which is probably my most insecure spot. So super happy about that. Um, and yeah, we just gotta keep rocking it. So this past week's workouts uh, have definitely been more intensive. So again, I got to go to the gym one day and I did um, an upper body workout and I just did a lot of different exercises to hit different parts of my body because I knew I probably wouldn't get to come back for a little bit. So I did something that hit like back, shoulder, bicep, tricep. I did some bench. Um, I got 225 for five reps on bench. I was really happy about that. It was on a Smith machine and so I've used them sometimes where it feels pretty normal. It just got, kind of guides where you go. This one felt a little bit resistant meaning it was kind of felt like it was almost helping me a little bit. So that 225 for five, I'm not gonna, you know, I may stay at that weight. I'm not gonna try to move up or anything because I want to be able to be super confident in that weight. Um, but still to go to that after a couple months of not even being in the gym because quarantine and all that, super happy. This last week's been a big motivating factor for me, um, just getting back on the horse. Um, also my friend Josh, I mean, I've been doing, he called them what, pylos, that's what he called them. Um, pilo I don't even know what it is. It's just um, conditioning. We cycle through about six exercises for anywhere. I might do 15 seconds or 20, 30 seconds per exercise with no rest. And so you do six of those and then you, um, the other person does them and then that's like your rest period and you do that three sets. So just something to get my conditioning up a little bit. I've still been going on like walks and stuff, trying to get some cardio. Um, and so, yeah, I think I've just been really consistent and that's why I'm seeing some, you know, a little bit of results because I actually am sticking to it. So I'm just super happy, even though I had that one bad day of eating, um, I actually fasted most of the next day, which is, I know not great, but it helped at least with the calories. But honestly, I just wasn't hungry. I had like a large pizza at dinner time and it carried me through most of the day. Um, and I felt fine. Like I actually did the workout that day where I was fasting. Um, I had plenty of energy, so I think all those carbohydrates just really came through throughout the day and that sort of fat. Um, and so that's not definitely not something I want to do all the time. Like um, I don't like fasting, but 
uh, you know, I just wasn't that hungry and so I just didn't eat. And I think that's, you know, so many people are like, you need to eat at these times a day, every day, you have to get four or five meals a day. I'm just kind of listening to my body um, and kind of doing what I feel works for me. And so far we're doing okay. So this has been about a month now um, in the making. And so, you know, we, we just got finished for this week. Now we're about to head into week five. Um, and so definitely excited by the end of next week and we look at week five, uh, how we're doing, you know, getting to almost the month mark and, you know, four weeks we've done this. Uh, it's, it's getting easier. I mean, it's getting like, it's so much mental I've noticed for me. And so my goals for next week, I think are just keep hammering out this consistency, man. I mean, it's really not too bad. Like if you cook good dishes, like I'm, I'm starting to learn how to cook some better food. Like I'm using potatoes now, which I wasn't at all. And they're actually not very high in calories. I try not to have them all the time because they're starch, but um, that's super good doing like that with egg and like chicken or turkey or something like that. Um, Josh has been a real um, help in the kitchen for me. Um, he's also kind of doing a weight loss thing right now. So um, yeah, that helped. And actually, I don't know when you're gonna see this clip in the, like the video, but um, you should see some footage of Josh either after this clip or you already saw it. So that's Josh, um, the one who was doing that workout in my apartment with me. So huge shout out to him. Um, I'm sure you'll see him again. But yeah, I think that'll wrap up uh, this week. Again, nothing but positivity right now. And uh, I also hope you enjoyed seeing Oliver, who's still behind me. I'm gonna hopefully have some more clips of him in the video and stuff. Um, but yeah, and hopefully this video is a little bit more exciting uh, just because I'm trying to get more stuff in it. So I'm not just standing here talking. Uh, that way Michael doesn't complain too much about me being bored. But yeah, also um, shout out to James and Julissa for bullying me for my thumbnails. Only a little hurt, it's okay. We're gonna move past it. This thumbnail, I don't know what it is yet. You already have seen it, but hopefully it doesn't get me bullied. Anyways, uh, thanks for joining guys. It's been a crazy month already. Um, hopefully we can smash 10 views on this video. <laughs> oh, I love being like an ironic YouTuber. Um, but seriously, it's, uh, it's been a good week. I'm, I'm super happy. I'm excited for next week. And yeah, I'll see you then. A little later.